When MRSA comes up in conversation, it doesn't get a positive reception. The ultimate yuck factor, the mere mention, makes our skin crawl. Well, contamination, infection, something gross. Evan Derby spends much of his day at a computer keyboard. The dirty truth is MRSA may be there too. Frequently found on frequently touched surfaces. In fact, 40% of us have the Staphylococcus aureus bacteria on us right now. MRSA is an antibiotic resistant strain of this bacteria. It can live undetected on our skin for a long time. Probably I am colonized with MRSA because I see so many patients. So a lot of people like us are colonized with MRSA. We are colonized and nothing happens. So you could be carrier of MRSA and have live a normal life. MRSA likes things warm and fuzzy. MRSA usually stays in moist hairy places, nose, axilla, groin region. Just because it's all around us doesn't mean MRSA is harmless. It can lead to severe antibiotic resistant infections. Spread through contact, you can pick it up from touching a compromised person or object, like a computer, doorknob, or gym equipment. To get a reaction, the bug has to have an entry point into your body. If there is a skin breakdown and it has a portal of entry, then it gives you an infection. Cleaning and covering cuts may prevent infections, which can range from a boil or abscess to severe, even life-threatening sickness. The best defense is hand-to-hand -hand combat. The best thing you can do is hand washing. Hand washing, hand washing, hand washing. Armed with this knowledge, Evan is soaping up and trying to stay hands off. I would touch things a whole lot less, that's for sure. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.